Bring your own cup or pay up. Just moments ago, the Berkeley City Council voted on whether to tack on an extra charge on drinks that require disposable cups. The Night Beats' Kristen Ayers is live in Berkeley right now following the story. Kristen? Yeah, Ken Berkeley making history tonight, passing that policy which will require anyone who wants their coffee or soft drink in a to go cup to pay up. I would really love for this ordinance to pass. Berkeley City Council chambers crowded tonight with supporters of an ambitious ordinance designed to cut waste and change the way you eat out in Berkeley. Without dramatic change in the products and packaging we consume, there will be more plastics in the ocean than fish by the year 2050. Berkeley City Council member Sophie Hahn's sweeping solution, eliminate disposable plastic foodware in the city. Under her bill, you have to either bring your own cup when you get a drink to go or pay 25 cents for a disposable one. Some people we talked to said it goes too far, even for Berkeley. 25 cents would maybe be too steep. As a student, I mean, I don't have a lot of money, and so having, having to spend 25 cents for a to-go cup is just, it, I, it's not right in my opinion. But others said they would simply avoid the fee by carrying their own dishes. Cal student Gina Wright is already doing it. I literally carry these around Yeah, and I don't use plastic spoons or forks anymore, or even compostable ones, because these are reusable. Han says a majority of Berkeley restaurants are already on board with her proposal, which requires them to switch to compostable takeout packaging. And she says this is just the beginning. In three years, the plan is to launch a program that would allow Berkeley residents to borrow reusable takeout containers and later return them. It's all about changing your habits to good ones, especially when the world is literally falling apart at the hands of human beings. That 25 cent fee officially goes into effect in January of next year. Live in Berkeley, Kristen Ayers on the Night Beat.